merch, man. It's just merch. It's just merch. Ah, it's just merch. Guys, this merch is so good, it should be illegal. Go shop at BigBearWeatherAndMore.com to get yours. Hey, what's up, everybody? So what we like to do every summer, or close to summer, is do a little ride on the chairlift and show you guys the different views. And yes, my baby was able to make it today. Hey, guys. So that's what we're gonna do. We're here at Snow Summit, and we're gonna take a cruise up the lift. The time to get on the lift for sure. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I love taking the lift in the summertime because you can get the really, really great views of the whole valley. Not that you can't in the wintertime, but these views in the uh, summertime are some of my favorite views. So I'm hoping it's gonna be as beautiful as I'm expecting. This is where you get your tickets to take the lift. You can pick, if you pre-order them, you can get it there. But yeah, sweet, sweet, sweet. Very cool guys, hanging at Summit for a minute. Hope you guys enjoyed the golf video. I thought it came out a lot better than I anticipated. Just because it was, you know, just playing the whole way, the whole time. But it's a beautiful course. I suggest you guys get your butts up here and play on that course. It's a lot of fun. And every hole has some pretty beautiful views. No, so it's the other lift. Okay. I wonder what, what I'm supposed to be holding right here. Doing videos where there's background music, it always demonetizes the videos, but the channel doesn't do good enough to earn anything anyway, so, you know, it's all fun. I love doing this, so hopefully you guys are enjoying it as well. All these dirt bikers, mountain bikers, actually, because I'm going on to the lift. Okay, well. I thought we'd have to go on, on, on this side, but. Let's see. You know what, there's a second line right there. We don't see see Ray. Where? Hey, excuse me, sir. Ray, can I can I get some service, sir? Come on, guys. That's what you. That's okay. Come on. Are you sure? No, no, come on. Good job, babe. I told him, man. How are you doing? Hot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hot. Hi, friend. <laughs> I bet, I bet. Guys, when you come down here, make sure you say hi to Ray. Always say hi to Ray. 
He's he's my big brother on the mountain. <laughs> Walk around this way. Okay. Bro. On the yellow line, my friend? Yes, sir. Side by side, you guys be back on before 4 o'clock to come down. You got it. Thank Have you. fun, dude. Thanks, bro. Water down, guys. Love you, brother. Love you, too, man. Enjoy. Thank you, Ray. <laughs> Sweet, guys. Well, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to extend this darn thing. As far as I think it'll go. Hopefully. And this uh, is very uh, nerdy of me, but I'm gonna put my pink hat on because it's not well, nerdy. For one, I can't afford to get more wrinkles. I'm already getting old, <laughs> and it's it gets really hot up here, guys. It does. The sun. It gets crazy hot up here. Yeah. Well, I mean, not crazy hot, but it does get nice and warm, <laughs> but way way better than most other areas down the mountain, except for where I grew up. Perfect weather down in Newport Beach. Perfect weather year-round. But yeah, this is pretty cool. Very cool. Look at the bikers. I definitely want to do something like that, but it, you know, obviously an easy trail. Oh, that was a close call. That was a close call. Very cool. See, we're starting to get some lake views. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I don't want to hold this up too high. <laughs> Clank. Break on top of this thing up here. Oh, that's going to go off. I'm just going to turn around. Make sure I capture this insanely beautiful view. That's true. So I'm going to do it going up and going down, you guys. This view is really crazy. This reminds me of like when they enter into Jurassic Park and they're on those little train or little carts being carted through. She's, she's talking about this area. Yep. Yeah, yeah, reminds totally, babe. Jurassic Park. It totally does. It totally does. Yep, we are sightseers coming up to enjoy the sights. Mm -hmm. And also, I know I've been telling you guys I've been trying to get some sort of a get together with those of you who would want to come up and have some fun so there's like the the hike opportunity that we could try to figure that out even if it's just like two or three of us or even golfing that would be fun but I think the hike just so you know everyone knows how to walk not everyone knows how to golf <laughs> even people who golf most of them don't know how to golf Don't trash summit, dang straight. So lush through here. That's because of all the man-made snow, all that extra snow they get, it really it keeps it really thick in here. Oh, we should have brought something to throw on that tree, babe. Do you see it? No, but do you, oh, there's someone right there at the bottom of the, uh, Wow. <laughs> no. Where? Oh yeah, there's some bras and some underwear and stuff like that. <laughs> That's so dumb. That is so dumb. Wow, look at that beautiful little stream of water there. Oh yeah. That's beautiful. Can you guys hear that down there? Wow, 
I bet that's super fresh coming out of there. Just beautiful this view. Hold the camera up as high as I can for a couple seconds here. This is going to be an interesting view. It'll be like standing up on the chairlift. I've never had that perspective, so I'm looking forward to seeing what it looks like. Gosh, I hope the camera doesn't fall off. And again, you guys, going down, I'm going to be doing the same thing. It'll be a, a nice view. I should probably the whole way up point the camera this direction so you guys can get the full perspective of going up and then going down. Oh, yeah. It smells so nice in here. It reminds me of when I was 13, I got sent to Outward Bound. It was a, an outdoor, well, outdoor wilderness is kind of an oxymoron, in a wilderness program because I got caught at 13 years old uh, participating in toking it up. <laughs> so my parents sent me away. And while I was there, I was miserable. But we got to do whitewater rafting down the Deschutes River and climb South Sister and Broken Top and do about 10 to 12 miles of hiking every single day for that three weeks. And this was in Bend, Oregon. And uh, in hindsight, some of the best time of my entire life. It was so beautiful, so much fun, but it was my first time being away from my mom for that long. So it was, it was not easy. Not easy at all. Oh my gosh, that view right there. Unreal. So way out there, that weird looking water, that's, Bald that's Baldwin Lake. And it looks nasty, I know. It is nasty. But it adds a different tone of beauty up here. And just beyond that lake out there that you guys are looking at, if you go over that little hill, you'll start going down into the desert. Oh. Losing it a little bit. It's just beautiful. Again, guys, we are so lucky to live here. On the way down, I'll keep the view on this beautiful lake shot the whole time and Baldwin. I love you so much. I am actually on the chairlift making a video for my channel. So I'll hit you up as soon as I'm done. Thank you so much, bro. All right. What's up, my brother? I'm on the chairlift right now. If you go to the video I'll be uploading in a few days at about the 14 minute mark of the chairlift, you'll hear me talking to you via text. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. So Monday is my friend Taylor's birthday, babe, and he's having, they're throwing him a party at his house from 5.30 to, to maybe 7.30. I don't know if I'll be able to stay long, if at all, but I said I'll drop by to give him a big hug. Would you want to go? You want to go? Yeah. Really? Oh, cool. All right then, babe. Huh? Will there be food? 
this woman right here if you guys knew oh my god seriously <laughs> seriously i'm hungry she is a hungry <laughs> she is and yet she's still fine <laughs> i don't know how she does it yeah what's up guys you, thank you sir thanks guys by four o'clock thank you this chair thank you All right, so we're at the top here, guys. They have trails galore. We're gonna take a nice look at San Gorgonio where there's still some snow. I wish I knew how to zoom in though with this camera, but I don't. Smells good, huh, babe? So here's a nice little restaurant up here. I used to work for this company called Levy, but I worked for them at Bear Mountain. And Levy's, I had a lot of fun. Let's put it that way. I had a lot of fun working there. I miss it tremendously because I miss being around all the people. And even six years ago, people recognized me from this channel. So that's uh, pretty darn cool, but yeah. Oh man, so that's San Gorgonio out there, you guys. And that's beautiful Rachel right there. <laughs> and there's a teepee, but almost complete. Wow. So again, guys, that's the restaurant right there. And they have a lot of great outdoor seating that have some amazing views if some of these trees right here got got, got the hex got cut down just right here I'm, I'm, I'm not for deforestation or anything like that so calm down but if they did cut some of these trees down that that view would be I don't know maybe the best view in this whole area just like five or six trees right in front of the restaurant right here yeah shall we uh jumper i was thinking I about it I, well, I, I was thinking about it well, we got your all day pass so. i know <laughs> i know i know <laughs> but last time the kids were so mean to me <laughs> it wasn't fun so yeah so if you get stuck up here when the lift is closed already then you have to hike back down or just crash up here yeah yep but i think that would be pretty cool to bring your camping gear up here and just is not take the lift back down and go set up camp right here yeah and then in the morning go back down highly doubt that's allowed but i was gonna say i don't think camping is allowed here but hey you guys are my friends that doesn't mean anything. <laughs> not when it comes to Big Bear. So you don't get any stuff. Yeah, perks you, for you're, that. Not, you're not going to get it. You might actually get in trouble for that. So, yeah. Yeah, so all these, these people are starting to head down this trail right here. Very cool. How much battery life do we have? Oh, sweet. You know, babe, let's walk over here real quick, okay?
Oh yeah, guys, it's so nice up here. Babe, it'd be so nice to camp up here. I, I think that's something that we should do, actually, sometime. Camp up here? Only problem is, like, if there's an emergency, we can't get down fast, you know? That's the only problem. Top gun in the back up. Take my breath away. That doesn't mean punch me in the stomach, baby. Oh, I hope they didn't get that on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, she's tough. She she takes a licking and keeps on ticking. <laughs> <laughs> she does. She actually opens up the can of whoop arse on me. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna head back down. Yes, we are. All right. Hamburgerless. I know. Did you did you want something? No, but it does make you want to make hamburgers. It for smells dinner really time. really good. Next time we'll know that they have it the. Makes you want to make hamburgers for dinner time. And oh, that sounds good. Yeah. And they have the restaurant open, which is great. Yeah. I think the last time we came up here, the restaurant was not open. Yes. Correct. going to be the epic views. Views that no one has ever seen like this from up here. Like no one's ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> this is the greatest view in the universe. Oh, look at this picnic area there. Oh yeah. There's a picnic picnic table. That's cool. Uh, let's see. So yeah, these views from way up here, you're not going to get this view often, folks, because of how high I'm holding this camera up here. Hey, this is going to be so nice. This, oh, look at that view. <laughs> Holy moly. I, I won't get mad if, if, the, if the thing stops, if our little call it lift stops because that view is incredible. Okay guys, now that we're being blocked from the tr by the trees here, we're going to pan over to the Baldwin side of town. Check out these beautiful beautiful views over here. Without knocking no, the off no, the damn no. thing. There's a lot of people that actually do this whole mountain biking thing. It's really cool. Uh, let's pan back a little bit. This isn't gonna hit, right babe, right babe? Oh, 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 okay, good. I can hold this as high as I want. We're not gonna have any obstructions, so that's good.
pretending to push me off the swing, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, he won't be laughing later. <laughs> As I said, it takes a licking and keeps on ticking. <laughs> I feel like the statue would be. Pulling the up like this. Thanks, babe. I would hate to be one of the people that works on these lifts and have to climb up these ladders because I have such horrible uh, heights for some reason. It's weird, I can do bungee jumping and stuff like that and it's not that big of a deal but stuff like this does bother me. Hey, it's a plane, it's a plane! Look, it's the plane! Hey, boss! Oh, s s smell that, babe? You're not supposed to be farting on the chair. No, not that smell. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yes, actually, it brings me back to a story in my childhood. When we used to go down to the reservation and we would pick up pine cones and throw them into the giant fire. Oh, that's cool, babe. No, I'm being serious. No, I'm 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 saying it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> they make this huge fire pit for the the sweat when they do like an Indian sweat. A sweat and, lodge. Uh huh. Yeah. They make a huge fire and they throw all these like um, lava rocks in there. You know how it goes. I've done them. Yep. And so we used to collect all the pine cones and throw them in there. And that smell of a burning pine cone is just oh, it smells amazing. so so divine. So yummy. It's divine. Absolutely. That's what my my mom would say. Oh, that's divine. <laughs> I love you, mom, so much. She's an angel. She's gonna be coming back up, hopefully in a few weeks, babe. Don't make that look. <laughs> He's lying. I did not make a look, mom. I'm totally lying. She made a finger gesture. I'm <laughs> How dare you? I'm That's... always so happy to see her. My mom loves this girl so much. She loves the banter against Nick and she just thinks I'm so hilarious. Which <laughs> she, makes me she, she does. love her so much more. <laughs> she does. I love making her laugh. She's got the cutest <laughs> laugh ever. She's she's an amazing lady. <laughs> she's always been so supportive and I mean any of, of you other ladies out there, if you had me as your son, I don't know if you guys would have survived. That's how tough my I mom is. I thought you were going to say husband. No. There's bras everywhere down there. Now I know where to go when I need one. Yeah. <laughs> they grow on trees. I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah, the bras grow on trees. Put your socks untied. Oh! <laughs> Dude, you are hilarious, man. <laughs> hey, you dropped your pocket. <laughs> I love it, man. I love it. I like it a lot. Oh wait, I forgot. I'm getting phone calls. Oh my gosh, of course I have like how many missed calls and I've responded to a bunch on this ride already? Eight. Insane. He watches the channel so so he can just be chilling one day letting this video play and then hear that joke be like hey I use that joke and then realize hey it was me. you guys would be amazed how many people I meet up here that actually watch the channel that's a lot just about every single day someone is like oh my gosh I watch your channel it's it's a really great feeling I can promise you one thing, my friend, it'll be the best, potentially, that you've tried in a long time. You'll be very happy. 
talking about uh, food. Talking to me? No. I was, t I was, I was doing a text message. Bing. I just heard food. Yeah, and then you got my attention. Yeah. I came out of my gate. <laughs> Alright guys, well, we're getting close to the end here. I think this is like uh, summertime sledding right here. But yeah, wonderful, wonderful. This battery lasted a good amount. It's got 53% more. I can't believe it. That is not like my GoPro battery. And guys, don't buy GoPro. These batteries overheat super quickly. You you could lose a lot of good footage, especially like when you go on your once in a lifetime journeys and, and you want to take some footage. Chances of it overheating within 10 to 12 minutes are so likely, and it's, <laughs> it'll 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 ruin it. So just be careful. All right. Thank you. Oh. Okay. Thanks. Thanks, Stu. Thanks, bro. You back already? You guys didn't hang out for a while? I just did the quick walk around. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Of course, I have a lot. Oh, you need a lot yeah. of calls. Right on. Well, get to work, sir. Thanks, bro. Love you, brother. I love you, too. It's good, yeah. to see you. good to see you, young lady. Thank you for everything, bro. Of course, bro. brother. Anytime, dog. Guys, make sure you say hi to this guy, please. High five. Boom. Oh, yeah. Here, here. Boom. <laughs> All, right. All right. Later, guys. See have you, guys. Day. Take care. Oh, you Are know. Are we going out there on my? Uh, you know what? We're okay. Jimmy Chipping Chipping Pang. Pang. Once again, guys, we were way up there. You can't even see where we ended up because it's way up high. Watch your step. These are some ankle breaking rocks. Careful, babe. All right, so we're going to say our goodbye right now, I think. So, yeah. Come up to Snow Summit, you guys. You don't only have to ski here. You can do some, some mountain biking, some sightseeing, a few other cool little fun things like summertime sledding and stuff like that. So come up here, enjoy yourselves. I love you guys. Sorry there's not as much content this time of year, but don't worry. In about four months, we could see our first snowfall. So oh. cheers, you guys. Peace out. Later.